How you doing? This is uh, Jason here from Sound Design. Uh, this tutorial is going to be on uh, your user defined section, um, your buttons and uh, assign section, rather, um, your, and, and then also your knobs. Um, the way that you're going to edit these, you're going to hit view right here. So then that'll bring you up to a section and it's gonna have it's gonna have uh you can change the colors again just like any other strips or whatever. Um the deal is when you're editing this section you have A, B, C, and D. So when you hit on A, it's gonna be a different set of uh it's going to be another set of effects or whatever you put right there. Um, and then also B is going to be a different set and C is going to be a different set. So we're just going to edit C uh, right now. So, like I said, when you're dealing with the like, deal, you can change the colors and all this kind of stuff. And like I said, that's, that's after you press this view button, you can go up here and start making these changes. So, um, your first the encoder is this first knob. Um, then a quarter, a coder two is the next next knob, three is the next knob, and so on. So, just like right now, I have the first encoder set to um, uh, set to so I can change different things on. A certain effect. You can also do stuff with sends, use it for uh, different remotes, MIDI uh, for stuff, um, dynamics, which you know, be your compressors or gate or whatever. Um, so, and it also shows you that, like, if I click on that, it'll say gate. Uh, you know, like the dynamics as far as your compressor, you know, the attack and hold on it or whatever. Um, but we're going to do effects. So, we're going to go, we're going to hit the effects button. And we're going to, I mean, these are the first effects that they have up in, in the board anyway. So, if you start from scratch. Alright, so we're going to set it to the delay which is our bus 15 which is mix 15 or whatever you want to call it all right so you hit the view button and go back to this mode so now you know which effect you're you're um, you're um, affecting because that's your effect one the second one is your two and three you see the numbers on the sides all right so, um, if I want to affect the, the the delay that we had on there, we go to uh, to number three because that's the one we're trying to deal with. And then we hit that, and then from there you can decide if you want to if you want that particular knob to deal with the mix, the timing on it, the mode. Factor left, factor right, offset, whatever, feedback, all those different things. So we're just gonna, as of right now, set it to the mix. After we click that, the knob will show up. Um, it'll show up in the first knob saying mix, and then if you're turning your knob, of course, that'll change. You can put however much percent on it that you want. Um, then the way, like you said, the way you get to the second encoder, just scroll down. And then, you know, I already have that one set to time or whatever. So that's how you would affect the, the, the knobs. Now, to go to the buttons, you just go down to where it says button 5, which it'll show you right there, you know, your numbers, um, which button you're, you're doing. So go back up here and say button five. I want it to the target type. I want it to affect, you know, uh, um, 
that particular effect. So I would hit effect button and then I would choose which effect slot I wanted to um, do something to my, my delay which is on effect 3 so I hit that and I want that to be the timing for it. So if somebody's singing I want to I want to basically use that as a tap delay. So if they're singing, I want to be able to tap that in, and and when they sing, uh, it's in the tempo of the song compared to delay just going all over the place. So when I set that to timing um, or whatever, of course, like I said, you have to click on these when you're going through it. Click on push in the button to select it. Then when I go down here, since that was five. See, it's showing you the tempo. So now, say I want to go fast. That's how fast my my delay would be. Uh, right now, I have button six set to mute that particular effect. So if they're sitting there singing, I want that effect to go off immediately. I'll just hit the the number six, and it'll mute that effect. You can also uh, set the different buttons to you know jump into certain pages or whatever so say I want this one to jump to um, we're just gonna say uh, yeah we're just gonna say we want it to go to setup alright we want it to go to the remote page alright so now that means my button set 7 is going to take this straight to the um, straight to the setup page. So now when I hit seven, I'm to the remote page. So it makes it easier if you have certain pages you want to go to or whatever really quick and really fast, and you set your buttons and and this and that to what you want to do. So that's how to assign the user define section and also. Set your buttons and, and well, not also, that's, that is your section, the buttons and the knobs. So, that's how you do it. Hopefully it helps you out. If you have any questions or anything, uh, feel free to leave comments or whatever. Appreciate it.